Animal shelters are over capacity due in part to an increase in owner surrenders. There are many reasons why someone might choose to surrender an animal, but the primary one is financial hardship. There's a new effort underway in Muskegon County to provide temporary assistance to dog owners in need, and it's all in memory of a dog that captured one woman's heart named Solo. Kendra Bowes met Solo after he was brought to Pound Buddies last year. I was his main handler, love him to pieces. Solo was stressed living inside the shelter, and although he is no longer with us, Kendra is honoring him through an initiative called Operation Solo. And he was much happier outside, so um, that's my main mission is to help people take care of their outside dogs. Operation Solo provides supplies like food, collars, and more to families in need just like Joe Nico Spears, a pet owner in Muskegon Heights. His dogs, Storm and DOG, primarily live outside. When they came out, they seen my dogs it was very healthy, and I showed them how much love and affection I give my dogs. And every since then, Kendra them been coming out, and they do web checks, and they provide food and love to the dogs, and I appreciate it very much. Jonigo says knowing Kendra has made a big difference in his life. It helps out when they can provide food for me because at times I'm working on this house. It's a fixer-upper, so a lot of times my money is pretty tied up. Kendra and her team are raising funds by selling bracelets online. Just $5 can help a dog stay in their home. The bracelets have been a big hit. I want to see everybody wearing these bracelets. Operation Solo recently held a successful food pantry at Glen Park Animal Hospital. They were able to provide food and other supplies to about 50 pet owners and more than 100 dogs. There's going to be 104 dogs that have their bellies full tonight. There's 104 dogs that have toys for maybe the first time. There's 104 dogs that have a brand new leash and a collar. Meanwhile, Joe Nico is joining the effort by spreading the word of Operation Solo's mission. You just have to reach out and look out to find out where's the help at. You can't be scared to ask for help and you can't be ashamed because you need help. Everyone needs help. Kendra says she wants to make sure that all dogs, but especially the ones kept outside, have everything they need to thrive. We want to teach them what we know. We want to just make sure that if they are outside that they're taken care of. So it's not a bad thing that dogs are housed outside. We have to kind of educate everyone in that and as long as people are doing it the right way. The right way, all in loving memory of an outside dog named Solo. Operation Solo has two more food pantries planned, one on October 1st and another November 5th. If you would like to support Operation Solo's mission by purchasing a bracelet, we have links to more information on our website, 13onyoursign.com.